know, how are you seeing some of the newcomers step up, realizing that there is that place that they can compliment you in the backfield? Um, I mean, one guy sticks out the most to me uh, is Kennedy. Uh, he's learning really, really fast, and uh, he's not even looking like a freshman no more. So uh, I really like his progress and where he's going. Uh, Crawford and uh, Petaway. They're still trying to figure out everything, get the plays done and stuff like that. That Everyone goes through that transition, so uh, we're waiting on them too. So uh, I feel like as a group, we we really didn't fall off anywhere. How did, you, know, you and Wendell were sort of you know neck and neck through the competition, and, and you were here at the same time. But now that you have so many newcomers, do you see your role and maybe your responsibilities in that team room, you know, in, in the position room, changing a bit this year? Uh, definitely. Uh, I'm a leader in my room. Um, as at times, I might not want them to, but everyone does look at me and watches everything I do. Uh, so I just got to embrace that role and uh, be the leader that they want me to be. You've had similar numbers each of the last two seasons, 700 yards rushing, seven or eight touchdowns each year. Do you set any statistical you know, marks that you want to hit? Is there a way that you can quantify success when you head into this season? It's that thousand yard mark, and, and uh, I just haven't broke it yet in my college career. Uh, so that's something I'm really, really trying to focus on. And that just starts with, you know I mean, big plays, explosive plays, uh, a lot of yards, um, a lot of runs over 10 yards, stuff like that. So uh, I don't worry too much about it because that's when you get like a 300 yard season.